With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. So in this question we have two particles of equal mass have velocities v1 is equal to 2 i cap uh, meter per second and v2 is 2 j cap meter per second. First particle has an acceleration a is equal to 3 i cap plus 3 j cap meter per second square while the acceleration of the other particle is 0. The center of mass of two particles move in a path of. So we have to determine the uh, path of center of mass and velocities of both the particles are given. Right, also acceleration. So let us calculate that uh, velocity of the center of mass. Right. Now velocity of center of mass that is given as m1 v1 vector plus m2 v2 right divided by m1 plus m2 okay and similarly acceleration of center of mass that is given as m1 a1 plus m2 a2 divided by m1 plus m2 okay so let us calculate vcm vcm will be equal to mass uh, the mass of two particles is equal right so i can take mass co common and v1 is 2 i cap 2 i cap plus v2 will be 2 j cap 2 j cap divided by m plus m 2 m right so therefore vcm will be equal to VCM will be equal to I cap plus J cap, right, meter per second. Now acceleration, that is ACM, that will be equal to, uh, right, this is vector, okay. So this will be vector, ACM vector, this will be equal to M1, uh, that means M common, A1, now a1 is given as 3i cap plus 3j cap 3i cap plus 3j cap um, plus a2 is 0 right acceleration of second particle is 0 divided by m1 plus m2 that will be 2m right so this will be equal to acm is equal to 3 by 2 i cap plus j cap right j cap okay now from here we can see that v uh, for vcm and acm um, the direction is parallel right in vectors i cap plus j cap determine the vector so for vcm the direction is i cap plus j cap and for acm direction is i cap plus j cap so this means vcm is parallel to acm Okay, so uh, when uh, both velocity and acceleration of a particle are parallel to each other, in that case the particle moves in a straight line. Okay, so this means that the correct option will be uh, option A. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level, trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.